Tonight, the moon is going to put on a show for you, a blood moon. A blood moon, also known as the total lunar eclipse. Tonight, the sky is going to put on a show for you, a blood moon, a complete lunar eclipse. It is the second time happening this year and this time it is going to be bigger, bolder, for the longest eclipse in almost a decade. For thousands of years, people looked at the red moon and thought and came up with different stories. The Mesopotamians thought that the dragon was going to eat away the moon. The Inca believed that the moon was bleeding to bless their harvest. And in medieval Europe, they thought and this was signifying a bigger change. But tonight, there is no place for myths and you will see signs in total action. It is so scientific that there exists a true story of how Christopher Columbus made use of this phenomena to secure him and his crew when they landed on an island unexpectedly. During his fourth expedition, Christopher Columbus landed on an island and he wanted food and supplies to secure his team because they were running out of food and they needed a place to stay. The villagers refused because these guys were aliens and they didn't want anybody to step foot on their island because of their own concerns. Now Columbus quickly referred to the charts and he realized that there was going to be an eclipse that night and he warned the villagers that if they had not provided him and his crew with food, shelter and other supplies, the moon was going to get angry. When this eerie phenomenon occurred, people of the village, were, people on the island were literally scared and they ended up giving them shelter, food and supplies. It is not that the moon is going to bleed. The moon shines because it reflects sunlight. But tonight, an earth is going to come in between moon and the sun, blocking off all the light. That means the moon is going to become dark. But how is it possible it turns red? Blue light, the very light that makes your sky shine blue, fades away. When that happens, you're left with red and orange. Now the red and orange light, they're cast on the moon. And that's the reason the moon looks like it's bleeding. Witness it without a miss.